What? What? All right then. Hey guys, how you doing? I'm HexDSL and this is The Bazaar, the platform I use to open conversations and make people think about stuff, often unsuccessfully, may I add. <laughs> so uh, today I've got a question for you, a moral question, if you like, moral is the wrong word. I've got a question for you. How much work is it okay to do in wine? You see, this has come up recently in my life with DXVK because... I'm kind of at the place in my life with wine where if there's a Windows game I want to play, I go to the Lutris website and I hit install. That doesn't work. I just delete it and just play something else. That's literally where I am. So when DXVK claims to make all sorts of wonderful things work, and by claim, I mean it totally does if you're willing to put in the work. Um, I was like, oh, I want to, I want to play The Witcher 3 in Linux. I, I, I really want to play The Witcher 3. How do I play The Witcher 3 in Linux? Um, so I started looking at DXVK. And I read pages. Like, I just kept reading. It just kept going down. You know, it was like, go do this, go do that. And then Glorious Egg Roll, the, the, the genius of the Egg Roll, um, he, uh, he made a script that automates a bulk of the process. And I'm still at, kind of at the point where I'm like, this is too much work. I feel like until Lutris just like folds in DXVK, so I can just do click and it just installs DXVK, or click and it just installs the game with DXVK. Um, I'm kind of like, it's too much work for a Windows game. Like, the problem I have, the reason that I, I fall down on this is like, I'll be looking at a game I want to play. I'll be looking at the game. I want to play that. And I'll go, okay. So I've grown, uh, there's no Lutris installer. So okay, I'll go to the wine web page and it's like, us oh, pages of text now to get this working. Pages of text. And I'll, I'll just go, I'm bored. I'll just, I'll just go, I'll, I'll, I'll just go play something else. Because the problem is, there are so many great games out for Linux right now. Why would you waste more time than you have to do with anything now the most work i've put into a game in ages was uh with overwatch where I, I said in the video from monday that i installed it and and then i had to like watch a slideshow for a bit while it built up a shader cache um that's wonderful and that was like not really work it was just me fucking around overwatch for an hour um i'm not sure i would have done more like i know it runs better in dxvk like i've heard that if i if i set my overwatch up in dxvk i'll be able to like, write boom boom boost the graphics right up you know play it on max and have a great time but i'm like that's too much work like even though i'm quite enjoying overwatch at the minute like you know basically i'm still like that's too much work and that's where i am on it i mean that's that's my thoughts and i don't think and see at the beginning of the video i said a moral quandary because it's not really is it it's, it's, it really comes down to literally how many shits you give versus like the game and work stuff it's like a big triangle of like with shits at the top and then like work and how much you like the game it has to be somewhere like closer to like 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 the game how much you like the game i don't know I'm, there's a venn diagram i don't know somebody will make it i'm sure, <laughs> sure someone else will reply to me with like a, just a jpeg of the image i was talking about and i'll be like damn i should have put it in the video uh, but yeah I, I won't um anyway the point here is that, like is like if you have to do work to get a windows game working when you know that that developer or publisher doesn't give any shit about Linux. So you're doing their job for them by making it work in your operating system. Is, I mean, is that a good thing? I mean, is, are we winning something there? Are we like, well, you didn't delete it and win on Linux, but we got it working anyway. I mean, is that us winning a prize? Did we did we win there or did they win? Like, did the developer go, well, we did fuck all and you're still playing Linux, so pff, your problem. Um, that's kind of like where I am with it. I'm, I'm like, I don't know which side I fall on this. Um, because, like, on one hand, it's, like, subversion. You know, it's intended for one purpose. And we use it for a different purpose. And that's that's something I'm oddly proud of. But then at the same time, we're saving them a job because they're, like, loads of people playing the Linux. Just these Lutris, you know, they're, like... And I don't think most publishers even, like, who don't support Linux care enough to even give us a second thought. But still, I, I don't know. It's, it's a comp... I think it's complicated. It's also, like just how much work you're willing to put in for a publisher that doesn't care about you. Because I've put I've put more work into games that come out for Linux and are a bit buggy. I've put more work into making them work correctly than I'm willing to do to make a game work correctly in Wine. I mean, there are rare exceptions. There are games I really like. There are rare exceptions to that, but everyone has that, right? Um, that said, 
like like when I when I reloaded my machine last week and I was trying to get Final Fantasy fourteen working, I was I wasn't having a good time. So I just started pricing up PlayStations. I was like, I just buy a PlayStation like on that. Um, that was where I was gonna fall down because I like the game, but I hate messing with mine. So I was like, I just buy a play. It turns out it just not changed the default install location, and it works fine as it turns out. Um, but yeah, it's it's fascinating to me the amount of stuff now that's working in one, even without DXVK, like without DXVK, like, like look, I'm, look I'm, I've got this is just my library. I've got Diablo, Final Fantasy fourteen, Guild Wars two, Overwatch, Ski Free, obviously. Um, you know, they're, they're the games I've got, and they just work off the bat, you know? And then if I could, if I actually had the inclination to get DXVK installed, I could be playing, like, The Witcher 3 on there. I could be playing Grand Theft Auto 5. I don't want to play Grand Theft Auto 5. You know, I could be playing all these all these games that are fairly new for Windows, like, fairly well thought of games, but games that are still considered to be AAA, because, as you know, AAA expires. But, uh, yeah, you know, it's like... It's amazing to me what a great... I mean, I was hard on the wine team. If you go back to my early videos, I just didn't use it. I was a dick about wine. I just was like, no, nope, too much work, fuck you. You know, I genuinely, I genuinely loathed the project. It just seemed like so much work. And that's kind of still where I am. But I think Lutris has made it so easy that I'm, I'm, I'm still at the point where I'm like, even though that's bollocks, I'm like, I just, you know, it's just so easy. Um, that's kind of where I am with it, you know? Um... But yeah, like like considering that one point I basically had the consideration that wine doesn't work. You know, wine doesn't work. And now I'm like now like like what two years later, I'm at the point where I'm going, should we use wine? You know, how much work should we put in? Rather it doesn't work. There's no real question that it'll work. I mean, like, there's games I've got installed that work. I've just said listed them. There you go. Not loads, but you know, listed them. Um most things at this point work in wine. Unless it's got some weird fucked up DRM, the games for the most part work in wine. I've seen I've seen. I've just assumed now that stuff is going to work in one. That's basically where I am. I just assume shit's going to work. Um, so yeah, I hope the one project keeps getting better to make life easier. And uh, I have the most respect for what they're doing now. Um, and that's turned around so much. But, yeah, I'm not sure that. I'm not sure whether like we're we're beating the publishers or the publishers are like oppressing us. I'm not sure. And that's the conversation I want to have. That's the, the answer I'd like to see in the in, in the comments, guys. If you have any thoughts on that particular point, please do let me know. This has been the bazaar. I've been HexDSL and hopefully I've fed your thought. Giving you food for thought. No, that's that's right. That checks out. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.